Dallas-based Southwest Airlines is under more pressure to shake up its management and operations. Yeah, an activist investment group says it now has enough stake in the company to call a special shareholder meeting, and that then could lead to some changes that would impact both employees and customers. Fox 4's Alex Boyer joins us now with the latest. Alex. Good afternoon. You know, Elliott Investment Management has been pushing for big changes here at Southwest Airlines since acquiring that minority stake in the company back in June. Uh, the hedge fund now has control of the required 10% of shares needed to call a special shareholder meeting. Now, the total ownership was disclosed in a government filing on Tuesday. Elliott has previously said that it intends to call a shareholders meeting to elect 10 new members to Southwest Board which currently consists of 15 people. Elliott is demanding that the Dallas-based carrier reevaluate its board of directors, bring in new leadership, and conduct a business review. Now, Southwest CEO Bob Jordan has pushed back on Elliott's demands and changes to some of its long-standing perks, like the popular bags fly free policy. Uh, Southwest and Elliott are scheduled to meet on September 9th. I talked to an SMU economist who says he's not surprised by the move, considering Considering Southwest has been struggling financially in recent quarters. It signifies to me that the market is working the way it's supposed to work. Uh, there's this myth out there that these so-called corporate raiders are just evildoers ready to suck the money out of a corporation. Sometimes that does happen, but most of the time you have a company that needs change and an outsider comes in there and does what they are allowed to do, which is buy shares of stock in the company to facilitate that change. Everything emanates from the top of the company. Uh, so the board is the top of the company. Uh, and whether Elliott's directors will be better than the existing directors, whether Elliott can even get their directors on the board, I hate to be so wishy-washy, but this is all one of these we'll, we'll see kind of things. In a statement, Southwest Airlines said, we remain prepared to meet with Elliott next week and look forward to sharing details on our continued transformation at our investor day on September 26. Now, recently, you may recall that Southwest Airlines announced a major change to its operation, talking about open seating that will soon be a thing of the past. Uh, Mike Davis says Southwest employees and customers really need to pay attention to how this process is playing out, because down the road, what happens here with this new group could ultimately affect them too. Back to you. All right, Alex Boyer, thank you.